everyone and welcome to my kitchen at home. I've decided that I'm going to do a chicken stir fry for my tea tonight and I thought I'd talk you through how to make it. Um, I've got myself a little helper with me today, our Finlay. Um, a lot of you've already met our Finlay so I'm going to get him to help me cut some of the vegetables up. Hope you enjoy our session. Bye! So hello everyone, um, the first thing you've got to do is to wash your hands. So now your hands are washed, the ingredients we need today are some peppers, one onion, uh, some baby corn, some mushrooms and some bean sprouts. And then what I've done here, as you can see, I've already marinated our chicken breasts and we've cut them up. Now, today I've decided to put some spices on because I like my food quite spicy. So I've put a Fujita mix in and I've marinated it for a few hours. Now, I'd probably recommend that you marinate it overnight if you have the time. If you don't, it's not a problem. So what we're going to do now, we're going to start cutting all our peppers and our onions and our mushrooms. Okay, we're going to start off by cutting our peppers. Now with the peppers, you've got to make sure that you um, make sure all the seeds are right. Now I know a lot of you have done this in the cooking sessions with myself, so you'll be um, a whiz at these. So just make sure that you get all the seeds out and take away any of the little white bits. You see what I mean? And here I've got my second little helper, our Isaac, who's decided to come and join me. Now he's going to help me cut the mushrooms up. So watch your fingers. Now I'm going to cut up the baby sweet corn. Now we're going to add the chicken into the pan. Now be very careful when you're doing this because the pan will get really hot. Now you've got to make sure that the chicken is cooked completely inside and out. And you'll see that the chicken will change colour. So you can see that happening nice. Now, as you can see, um, our chicken's been cooking now for about 10, 15 minutes. And what we decided to do was actually cut the pieces a little bit smaller, but it's completely up to yourself. Now you can add your onions. Give that a good stir so it's all like mixed around. Now you're going to have to start adding your mushrooms. Your mushrooms and your onions take the longest to cut. Can you finish 
serving your mushrooms. Uh, just add the remaining... And there you have it, our chicken stir fry. Now I've decided to make some rice with mine tonight. So I'm going to place this up now. Now as you can see, it looks absolutely delicious. It's not this town where you can add whatever sauces you like. Uh, you can have like, a bit of Nando sauce, some sweet chilli or some like mayo, whatever sauce you like. Okay, on mine I'm going to add some chilli flakes as well. I've just got sprinkled through there again. And there you have it. Thanks for watching everyone. I uh, hope you enjoy your meal. I've really enjoyed cooking with my mum tonight. Um, hope I see you all soon. Bye. Thanks for joining us. Bye.